that crash, I'll be driving a different Mopar. But this city is notorious for having the most aggressive cops. And I'll be running from them pretty much this entire video. And you'll see, these cops are worse than GSP. Plus, I got some really interesting Mopars we'll be driving later in the video that you probably couldn't even guess right now if you tried in the comments. Like, go ahead. If you're trying in the comments, I guarantee you won't be able to guess all of them. This is a scat pack. It's not an RT. I don't know why it says RT in the back. Oh, no. That cop's after me. What the f***? <laughs> I didn't even realize. Yeah, um, the interior for this specific mod oh! is not really uh, finished, but the other mods we'll be using in this video does have some finished interior, so don't worry. Hold up. I definitely meant to do that. I was just trying to turn around. I evade the police. <laughs> I'm really getting that active in this cat pack. Nice. Now we have to get reckless with it because I thought the police would maybe crash. Oh, maybe this dumb pull out in front of me will make me crash. Yep, that's definitely a crash. <laughs> Time to get in a different Mopar. Now we're in a Hellcat swap Chrysler 300. I was thinking it makes sense to switch to a Hellcat next, but... I don't want it to be something basic like a challenger or a charger right away. We will drive a charger Hellcat a little bit, but the Chrysler Hellcat is pretty fun. Watch. Oh, wait, hold up. It has a flame too. <laughs> I can turn it on and off with just the press of a button too. So that's pretty cool. This isn't a normal Hellcat engine either. It's been modified with like a stage four game shaft and some other stuff. Like it probably makes like a thousand horsepower. Don't pull in front of me, you dumb. Really? <laughs> that doesn't count. I was just making a turn and I barely topped that curb. I don't know if there's enough traffic to really cut out, but if there's any gaps. <laughs> I'm gonna hit though, you know? I'm gonna get active. I think 160 is pretty active. Uh, 170, 180 on the public freeway, maybe a little bit too active. Okay, that was definitely way too active. <laughs> now we're in a Hellcat Charger Red Eye. And this does have like a full interior done too. So let's get a little first person action going for a second. Hold up. Maybe I can, you know, cook a little harder in the first person. Watch out. Okay, still got some power. It's still a Hellcat. Don't get it misconstrued. I mean, mi I can't talk. Don't get it confused. It has a Hellcat engine still. Still a Hellcat. Oh, did I just hit that car? Dude, what the f is that cop doing? Yeah, just got pit. Okay, that does not count. I did not crash. I just got pit maneuvered. That's all. Getting pit maneuvered again. I didn't crash though. I only got pit maneuvered. That's all. He crashed into me. Okay, hold up. <laughs> Dude, these cops are so. This is what I mean. These cops are so aggressive. It's not gonna be easy to just drive the car around town. But after I make this turn right here, <laughs> they'll never see me again. Did not know it turned this hard. What the f What the f Was that my headline? Dude, what? I didn't crash though, for real. Like, my bumper's not damaged, so. Squeeze bends with it? Oh, they're closing my gaps. Hmm. <laughs> Like, this traffic is not really the most optimal for cutting up, but kind of more optimal for losing the boards because I have the room to put down this power, if you know what I mean. I think I might have just lost them, too, with that little maneuver through the gas station. <laughs> they have no clue where I They somehow knew I was going to be right here and set up a roadblock in time before I approached that part of the road. That definitely seems realistic. While I'm driving, I'll kind of speed through these back roads. Hmm. 
Dude, what the f*** are you doing? <laughs> Just blocking both sides of the road? <laughs> what if that was a civilian passing through? I mean, I am a civilian. Oh my god! Dude, not even GSP will rip off my wheel. What is wrong with y'all? Now we got something real different. A track car. It still has a Hellcat engine. It's still a Mopar. But it's our first SUV of the video. So, if you don't know anything about cars and SUVs, SUVs are a lot more difficult to, you know, control, handle. Especially if it has a lot of horsepower like this one does. And you'll see that here in a moment. As I just make these turns, I even... 80 miles per hour the car's gonna be leaning pretty heavy a lot of understeer too through the turns <laughs> it's all-wheel drive though so it might be actually faster than that charge we were just in and holy sh what are these cops doing <laughs> is he coming after me it was a setup he saw the track off he was like oh let me just pull him over just cuz not gonna catch dude that was super weird ai just took over my video again and made it look like i crashed but like i would never crash at least not like that like ai did me real dirty right there come on oh no this is what i mean this is where the suv tendencies come in i'm gone though <laughs> You can put me in an SUV, you can put me in a boat. I'm still gonna lose the Jakes. It's just, it's not about what you it. It's not about the car you're driving. It's about the driver driving the car. If you know what I mean. Watch, I'll lose the cops right here. And the track car. On a super curvy back road too. Watch. Speed limit 20? <laughs> I'm gonna go like 50. <laughs> Maybe 40. I don't know. I'm not trying to crash. And then right here is the freeway, and I'm already in a whole nother state at that point. Maybe I took that turn a little bit too fast. <laughs> now we're in a pickup truck with a Hellcat engine. This is a Ram TRX. If you don't know what that is, I just explained it to you. I don't know how much power this one has. Probably a stock engine. It should be all-wheel drive, though. Hopefully, I mean, it's a pickup truck. <laughs> 4x4, four four, that, that must mean all-wheel drive or something, right? Dude, look how high I look off the ground. <laughs> Like, the truck is so much higher than, like, every other car I typically drive. It's handling these turns pretty well, though. I'm going, like, 80. <laughs> oh. A little understeer. I don't need my taillights anyways. It feels a lot slower than the track car, though. A lot slow. Dude, AI took over my video again. Like, I don't know what I need to do, but AI is really becoming a problem. I don't know what to say. Can I drift this? Okay, I'm gonna crash it intentionally at this point. Let me just drift or something into like another car. <laughs> Traction control's off, so it's gonna get real rowdy. Hold up, let me just make this turn. E brake, hit that cop. No drift. Nice. <laughs> that was the the drift. Hold up, we're getting a little loose right there. E brake maybe. E brake didn't do anything right there. Do I really can't just power through cars? I have a Hellcat engine and this is a big truck. <laughs> I don't even have to stop for civilians. to stop for civilians now we're in a v6 charger i don't know if you would classify this as a mopar but it kind of is so if you want to see me take this v6 and turn it into a hellcat watch this video on screen right now 